open mic at Club Dada that Sunday night, meet Fred for the first time, and he's got his sitar, and he asked me if I wanted to play with him, and, you know, I'm always kind of down for some free form, whatever, but not, like, you know, all about it. And I was like, sure, and he's like, okay, play anything you want as long as it's a seat. So we get on stage, you know, and, and I start playing a C, and I keep playing a C, and Fred starts rocking out on his sitar, and it's really great, because he's just taking, like, the melody, and he's going with a, you know, a solo and a great line, and everybody is just floored and just watching, and it, it's great. And for five minutes, like, I was trying to figure out all the new ways to play a C, and so right, right there, though, right there, you made me think in a different way. So. Everybody's like, you don't know Fred? You don't know the amazing Fred? You don't know what? Like you're six. I'm seventeen. No, you're seven. In a few months. Seventeen in June. Yeah. That's right. So I don't you're know where I'm gonna have my birthday this year. Sixteen going on seventeen. That's right. Sixteen going on eighty-three. Right. Uh, playing a few bands. Mostly, I'm doing photography now. Um, I work with Hal Samples. He has a studio over on Main Street. He's a great photographer. Um, I'm in college, and uh, next year I'm moving to Portland to pursue my dreams. I never really enjoyed the school atmosphere, like got caught up in the whole high school element. I'm just sort of like doing my own thing right now. kind of spans the gamut, you know, he, he's jumping from one thing to another and you never know what to expect out of him. Oh, I came up with the name for my alter ego, okay. Esther Skrakowski. I love it. She's 83 and fierce. What is it like to be in a band with Fred? It's actually hilarious. Pretty like, painfully normal child. Went to private Christian school for elementary school and then I went to Baptist school for middle school and that's where, that's where I really think I found myself because I didn't know what I wanted at that point but I knew I wanted to do nothing with anything those people had to do with. Fred's energy is my favorite, you know, he just he just em embodies this this youthful exuberance and, and he's just a positive force. You, um, hey girl. you're in a band. Yes I am. I just started going out to shows because I was just sort of like over high school. I had like senioritis at 11. I think I definitely have a different drive than kids my age, but everybody has their own personal path. You know, no judgment whatsoever. I'm not condescending. I don't feel like I'm better than anybody. Like, I am just living my life. I'm doing what I love. They're doing the same thing, whether that's like going to football games or doing the whole high school dynamic, whatever. But like, as long as they're happy and they're doing what they love, then props to them for like, doing it, you know? Usually people that are 15 or 16 year old act like they're 15 or 16, but Fred does Everybody's been so great in Dallas, and that's what I love, like, meeting you and making, meeting all these other people through jolts that, like, are completely non-judgmental of age, and, like, see people for people and not as an age. It's gonna be really hard moving to a new city, but, because I only know a handful of people in Portland, but. I mean, it's gonna be a great experience. My plan, I definitely have a plan now, but I don't know, it might change. I mean, that's life, really. Like, your plans change, and different experiences change you, and there's obstacles, but I think I think my life's gonna go along the same lines as I wanted to. I see great things for him, you know, and, and my only hope for Fred and where he is 10 years from now is that he's following this, whatever it is, whether it be music, whether it be photography, whether it be fashion, whatever that little man wants to do. As long as it's coming from here, it's going to be awesome. So. I'm just glad I have motivation and a plan because I don't know what I'd do without that. Like, I just know what I'm going to do. I love that feeling. Like, God, just like having a place to go and having things to do. I only did so little. Like all these people who I've met, all these beautiful, fantastic people, have helped me more than anybody else, getting me where I need to be and 
helping me just reach for my dreams, even though it's like really cliche, but it's true. Like, yeah. just granting me all these opportunities so I can be happy. things ahead for Fred. Don't fall in love with me yet We only recently met you I'm in love with you But you might decide I am not Give me a week or two to go absolutely cuckoo Then when you see your error Then you can flee in terror Like everybody else does I only tell you this cause I'm easy to get rid of And now if you fall in love And now that I'm on the make And if you make a mistake My heart will certainly break I'll have to jump in a lake And all my friends so blame you, there's no telling what they'll do It's only fair to tell you, I'm absolutely cuckoo Don't fall in love with me yet We only recently met you, I'm in love with you But you might decide I'm not Give me a week or two to go absolutely cuckoo